This is Play North, the Manitoba Game Show. Joining me today are Kim Laycock, Kelly Scallion, and Jenna Bruderer. They're with the Merchandise Committee as part of the games. Uh, just before we get to you guys, let's mention the dates for the games. We've only got nine months to buy a whole bunch of stuff and to get up and running. So March 4th to 10th, 2018 is when the games will be in Thompson. You can follow us on all social media, at Manitoba Games. And uh, if you're hashtagging anything, putting pictures on any social media, use our hashtag, Play North, and to volunteer. ManitobaGames.ca is the place to go. I'm so happy to see you guys. Uh, I'm part of the communications committee. We're trying to get the word out, but really what you guys are going to do is help us to spread the word as well and uh, get some spirit going for the Manitoba Games. We've got lots of awesome stuff here and a lot more to come, but uh, before we get into that, let's get a little snapshot of maybe how you got involved in the games and any past games experience you have. I'm guessing you've got a little bit more experience <laughs> than these guys, so we're going to slide right over here. Uh, Kim Laycock, leading the, the merchandise committee, how'd you get involved in the game? Um, we were upstairs at the curling rink and Sandra was mentioning <laughs> the Manitoba games and we said we'd help, so we got an email the next day and we were on the merchandise committee. Perfect, and have you been involved in the games before? Did you happen to play in the games? Maybe, I'm guessing maybe your boys did uh, a romp yeah, through somewhere along the line. I remember playing in the games, but yeah, Brady in 2006 played hockey in the games, so yes. Perfect, so you got some games experience. And do you remember the 94 games at all? Yeah, no? No, Nothing? barely. <laughs> <laughs> Put you on the spot. The kids are really little. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, just before we get to you guys, any games experience, or is this your first uh, run through Manitoba game stuff? First experience. This will be first for me. Perfect, but uh, from having known you guys, you've been volunteering around town a lot, so it's not like uh, volunteering is is brand new to you in any stretch of the imagination. Um, so let's get right to it. We're sporting the stuff. We look pretty we good. We are, look at us. <laughs> so what kind of merchandise do you guys have to, uh, to share with the community? Well, it was really exciting. We got to choose from a lot of great options out there, but we went with some classics. Um, Bruce, you are sporting our long sleeve spun cotton tee, Euro <laughs> cotton I believe, I might have said that wrong. So the big crest, and you'll see that on all of our logos, all of our merchandise, everything like that. 2018 on one sleeve, Tom's on the other, super exciting. $22 for the long sleeve shirt. Oh, I love Steal it. Steal of a deal. Uh, Kim, Kim's sporting our hoodie. Same thing, has our big logo on it, super excited to have that. Um, that is our hoodie, it comes in a couple different colors, and that's $50. Uh, Jenna is wearing, now we're going to have these in men's and ladies cuts because that's very important. <laughs> uh, but the price doesn't change. There's $17 for the cotton t-shirts. Oh, wow. And, oh, I have it. Um, this is the t-shirt. I had to think for a second which one it was. I'm wearing the ladies cut of the tech t-shirts. So for all of us, you know, super sweaty people, yeah. these are going to keep us cool and calm. These are also $17 and we have the logo on the front. And then the 2018 on the back. <clears throat> now, if you're not into clothing, because mm -hmm. not all of us are. No. Nope. Well. Well. We, well. We okay. Maybe on, we all should be in buying, a little buying bit of game, clothing. Buying games gear doesn't appeal to everybody. Okay. So we wanted to broaden our horizons, and we know that because we're going to be the Winter Games, we're going to be a little chilly, um, and we're going to be in a lot of arenas. So we have the seat cushion. Ooh. Ooh very, very nice. nice. A pocket. Very nice. And these are very affordable, $5. Beautiful. Save your bum a little bit of... <laughs> Believe me. Uh, for we've, a lot of we've, we've been on a few cold seats. It's, it happens. And again, arenas are cold. So we have this wonderful sweatshirt type material blanket uh, with the Manitoba crest on it. And that one's $25. Love the blanket. Great yeah. idea. Mm -hmm. And hydration is key. Mm -hmm. So for $7, you can purchase a wonderful water bottle. Very important because we'd rather you refill water yes, bottles than exactly. have throwaways, right? Save so mother. Use recycle. Yep. And uh, for again the cold arenas, we also have the tumbler, and the tumblers are twenty ounces, and they are twenty dollars. Twenty go. ounces, twenty dollars. I think I remember. Uh, yeah. Um, so that is what we have for merchandise right now, and there'll be a variety of colors and sizes. We have extra small to double XL in most of our clothing products. Um, so we tried to find things that would appeal to everybody. Work for everybody. So now that we've seen this and we've got our wallets out, uh, where can we get a hold of some of this kind of stuff? 
going to be first at the Leisure Mart, which is September 8th and 9th. We're going to have a table with all of this available. Um, it will be cash only, so be, sh be sure to hit the ATM before you come. But uh, we're going to have everything there. Um, we're then going to have an online website that you can order from, and not just Thompson, but anybody in Manitoba will be able to purchase items from. Uh, that will be, um, the link will be available on the social media, so everybody will be able to find it. We are looking into doing maybe like a little pop-up store before Christmas to do some last minute Christmas shopping, and then we will have a store on site during the games. I love it, and I think I heard this. Tell me if I'm wrong, and if, if I am, then Paul will just edit it out, and Perfect. it'll be fine. Okay. But uh, you can order the, when you order this stuff online, there's almost a little bit more selection because you can choose your colors, and you can choose your sizes, and all those kind of things. So you guys aren't going to have a giant warehouse full of clothes, not right away. Not but right our, away. But our options are pretty big. Am I correct on that? Yep. And you, like it's the online, if we don't have your size in our hands today, you can go online and order the size that you need or the color that you want. Um, but we're hoping to have lots of variety so people can grab it and have it in their hands today. Absolutely. Yeah. It's, uh, it's that kind of world. We want everything right now. Right now. I can't wait. Uh, one last thing. I know you're planning a little something to try to get the games gear out there, to try to get the community going on the Fridays. So tell us about the Fridays. We're hoping to initiate a Fan Friday aspect to try and engage people, make them aware of the games, bring some spirit to Thompson. So we want businesses and groups throughout the community to wear the gear on Fridays. Take pictures with your group, put it on social media, show that your support um, is there for the games and for the athletes. And just to increase awareness, get people excited and show the athletes that we're behind them. It's exciting that this is happening in Thompson and all our athletes get a break from traveling. So <laughs> let's get behind them and show them our support. For sure, I love this casual Friday idea. What a great excuse to wear a t-shirt to work on yep. Friday. So, uh, or a sweatshirt, or I suppose you could wear the blanket. The blanket. Yeah, you'd have to have a special kind of job. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like, like, Paul, like Paul does, I think. Yeah, exactly. Where does the cape? An accessory. There you yeah. go. For sure. We'll pretend this is Friday already because we got our games gear on, but I'm committing to starting to wear mine on Friday and from every Friday and maybe some other days too, yeah. uh, all week long. Make sure, too, when you do that, you hashtag Play North because that's uh, kind of the way that we're sharing stuff. So games are coming March 4th to 10th. Thanks for joining me, Jenna, Kelly, Kim. Uh, the merchandise committee. We want to sell lots of this stuff. Come and uh, get on the get on the web, order some stuff, or come, come see. Come to the Leisure Mart. Yeah, come okay. see us at Health and Leisure Mart. Uh, remember, find us on social media at Manitoba Games. Hashtag Play North. The games are coming up March fourth to tenth. They are the 2018 Manitoba Games, powered by Manitoba Hydro.